Welcome to the two minute drill with Envision Tell. In our session today, we're going to show you how easy it is to use the new plugin from Envision Tell called Enlighten Connect to insert and manage Adobe Connect materials from your Adobe server inside your instance of Moodle. In today's two minute drill, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to insert and manage content from your Adobe Connect server over in your Moodle account. Now the first thing I need to do is, um, if you look here, I've got a meeting that's set up inside this course. Now if I click into the live meeting link, you're going to notice that there is no link here that allows me to actually enter this meeting room and it actually says mm -hmm. this activity closed on Saturday the 11th of July. So I'm going to show how easy it can be to update the content so that Moodle is managing the access to a particular meeting room. So I click the button that says update this Adobe Connect activity. I'm going to scroll down and there is a timing section right here in the middle of the page. Um, I can set the, uh, the date and time when this activity will begin. I can also set a date and time for when the activity will close. I'm just going to go ahead and set this for the 12th because today is the 12th. And if I scroll down and hit save and return to course, I'll be able to click into my live meeting link and now there is a link that will allow me to launch this Adobe Connect activity. So using Moodle, we can control access for students to particular live meeting instances. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to jump back to certification and I'm going to add some additional content to this particular course. I'm going to jump over to my Adobe Connect server and I'm going to go to my content tab. And then I'm going to make sure I'm on the my content uh, sub navigation. And then I've got a folder called Captivate Projects. I have a file in here called Adding Users. This is a little tutorial we, we uh, created using Adobe Captivate that shows how to mass import users into your Adobe Connect server. And uh, I just need to take note of the custom URL portion of my content link. And according to this, it's just adding users. So I'm going to jump back over to Moodle. I'm going to scroll back up to the top. I'm going to turn editing on and then come down to section three here and I'm going to add an activity and I'm going to choose the Adobe Connect activity option from the drop down. This will bring me to my wizard which will allow me to name and define this content. So I'm going to call this uh, adding users. My description, uh, I'm not going to take the time to type up a description now. I'll come back to this. This is my description. Like I said, I'll, I'll come back and, and clean this up later. And then I just need to add in the custom URL portion of my Adobe Connect content, which was adding users. And I'm going to make this activity actually be available from the 1st of July until the end of July. So people have, in theory, a full month to access this particular content. And then I'm going to go ahead and click Save and Return to Course. And just like that, there was a uh, a link added to my content. Let me uh, turn editing off. I can click into adding users. And just like that, we've added a link into Moodle, which allows us to access this Captivate file right within the learning management system. And that's how we add and manage content from Connect inside of Moodle. Thank you for watching today. If you'd like to learn more about e-learning solutions from EnvisionTel, please visit our website at www.envisiontel.com.